What's up, Tino? It's Comlox, and welcome to a new weapon review. So here's the Psychron, the Infinite Ammo Energy Pistol. What attracted me to this design of this pistol was its corpus and somewhat nostalgic aesthetic to those familiar with the Fantasy Star series. But since its inception in update 20.3, it has gone over several patch changes and buffs. So let's see where it stands. So here are the stats that I think to find the Psychron. It has a great 30% status chance, meaning that with 4 dual stat mods it can easily achieve 100% status. It has a 1 second delay on the auto reload with 40 units of ammo per second on ammo regen, which is great. It has an innate 1 meter punch through, which is really handy when facing clustered mobs and it can help spread certain status procs that can travel such as viral. And obviously it doesn't use any ammo pickups. Some of the disadvantages could include Damage ramping, up from 20% to 100% over 0.6 seconds when firing, and after throwing stops for 0.8 seconds. The damage decays back to 20% over 2 seconds. It has low critical chance, below average critical damage multiplier, and a limited quote unquote range of 24 meters. Remember, this information comes straight from the wikia, but sometimes testing and user experience can be different versus the information provided may not be necessarily as a disadvantage. Results will always vary. So yeah, let's see how the Cyclone fares. So if anything, the post buff stats were really a great improvement. The Cyclone by default is a status based weapon, but it can be a pretty solid crit damage weapon as well. The gas build wasn't great, but that was due to the enemy type I was using. But what ended up doing well was the hybrid crit and corrosive build. With the increased fire rate and status chance and better magazine size, mods that serve as much as multi-shot will serve this weapon very well in the status proccing department. Not to mention how much faster this weapon reloads now versus its launch stats. Though it's not as optimized as I can get it to be, this weapon does well for 2 forma. And also I thought it would be fun to showcase a little bit of the soft of how well this weapon does in dual wield mode, with the Psychron having status based procs on top of more status based procs with a glaive that has condition overload built into it, well it just does amazing. So thanks for stopping by channel. If you found this video to be useful or helpful in any way, please leave a comment, like, and a sub down below. See you, Tano.